What is the spring equinox? The spring equinox marks the official beginning of the spring and the end of winter. It usually falls around March 20th or 21st each year. What is an equinox? The word equinox is Latin and means equality of night and day. So, the equinox comes at a specific moment in time when the sun is exactly above the equator. When the equinox takes place, Everyone receives about 12 hours of daytime and 12 hours of nighttime. In fact, the sun is located exactly above the equator twice a year. So there are two equinoxes each year. The other equinox marks the beginning of autumn and takes place around September 22nd each year. The earth is tilted on an axis. As the Earth orbits around the Sun, this tilt means that half of the Earth is closer to the Sun than the other half, and therefore receives more light and heat. This is what creates the seasons, and it's why we experience longer days in the summer than we do in the winter. Twinkle Tidbit Many people think that an equinox lasts an entire day. However, this is not true. It is only a certain point of the day that is actually classed as the equinox as that is the point where the sun is directly above the equator. How do you celebrate the spring equinox? Ancient peoples tracked the sun's movements. The Stonehenge and Machu Picchu are examples of seasonal markers from ancient times. Some traditions from long ago are still practiced today. Crowds still gather for the spring equinox at Chichen Itza, an ancient Mayan ruin, to see the snake-like shadows dance across the stairs of the monument. In Japan, the spring equinox is marked by a national holiday where many people remember their ancestors. This event is called Shunbun Nohi. The spring equinox marks the start of a new year for people who live in Iran, Afghanistan, the Kurdish regions of Iraq, Turkey, Syria, and throughout Central Asia. This is in accordance with the Persian calendar, and this celebration is known as Nowruz. This has been celebrated for over 3,000 years. People celebrate Nowruz for two weeks, and often spend it seeing relatives, eating traditional food, and traveling. Many people also prepare for Easter on the spring equinox. The spring equinox actually plays an important role in calculating the dates for when to celebrate Christian Easter, as well as Jewish Passover. In fact, Easter Sunday typically falls on the first Sunday after the first full moon occurring on or after the spring equinox. Try it yourself. Track the length of days and nights leading up to the spring equinox. Grab a calendar and record the sunrise and sunset times for a full month. What do you notice? You can also try a test of old folklore. Some people say that if you set out an egg on the equinox, it will stand up. Some people say it works. Some say it's an old wives' tale. Can you look up the exact time of the equinox in your state? That's all for now. For more information and resources related to the spring equinox, head to twinkle.com.